This is an amazing technology from University of Texas at Austin. This hydrogel tablet can purify a liter of river water in an hour. A liter is about 2.11 pints. This is from University of Austin at Texas on FIS.org. So you can imagine, I mean, a lot, river water is really, really um, dirty. I mean, it has algae in it. It has all types of uh, leaves, remnants, and uh, could be muddy and murky. So using this hydrogel tablet to purify water requires zero energy and input. As much as a third of the world's population does not have access to clean drinking water, according to some estimates, and half of the population could live in water-stressed areas by the year 2025. So finding a solution to this problem could save and improve lives, obviously for millions if not millions of people, and it's in high priority among scientists and engineers around the globe. Now we know a lot of countries, they don't drink the water, and it's even dangerous to eat the vegetables and fruits uh, that are washed under tap water. Uh, you can have some kind of a disease, a dysentery as well, and uh, they only drink uh, bottled water. Now, scientists and engineers at University of Texas at Austin created a hydrogel tablet that can rapidly purify contaminated water. One tablet can disinfect a liter of river water and make it suitable for drinking in an hour or less. This is fantastic technology, right? Our multifunctional hydrogel can make a big difference in mitigating global water scarcity because it's easy to use. I support my Patreon account since YouTube has again demonetized my YouTube channel. The daily posts are five videos daily and they are totally different from what I have on my YouTube channel. Thank you so much for your support and that you find all my content so interesting. You'll find the Patreon account details in the description box below. So obviously it's easy to use, highly efficient and potentially scalable up to mass production, said Gui Hua Yu, Associate Professor, professor at the Cockerell School of Engineering, Walker's Department of Mechanical Engineering, Texas Materials Institute. Yu and his team recently published their findings in the journal Advanced Materials. Today, the pr primary way to purify water is to boil or pasteurize it, but that takes, of course, energy, plus a lot of time and work. That is not practical for people in parts of the world without the resources for these processes. The special hydrogels generate hydrogen peroxide to neutralize bacteria at an efficiency rate of more than 99.999%. The hydrogen peroxide works with activated carbon particles to attack essential cell components of bacteria and disrupt their metabolism. The process requires zero energy input and does not create harmful byproducts. The hydrogels can easily be removed and they don't leave any residue. In addition to purifying water on their own, the hydrogels could also improve a process that has been around for thousands of years, that is solar distillation the use of sunlight to separate water from harmful contaminants via vaporization. Solar distillation systems often run into issues of biofouling, the accumulation of microorganisms on equipment that causes it to malfunction. The bacteria killing hydrogels can prevent this from happening. A highly vigilant graduate student, Yu Hong Jui, Ju, uh, Juo, discovered these hydrogels Unexpectedly, while he was doing something else, that is purification of water with sunlight, this is what Keith Johnson said. He's a professor at the Maqueta Department of Chemical Engineering who co-led the project. The team is working to improve the hydrogels by increasing the different types of pathogens and viruses in water that they can neutralize. And the team is also in the process of commercializing several prototypes Scaling up these hydrogels would be straightforward, the researchers say. Materials for making them are inexpensive, and the synthesis processes are simple and remain that way at large scales. They can easily control the shape and size of the hydrogels, making them flexible for different types of uses. So this is fantastic. This is by um, uh, advanced jury. It was... Um, this article was on Journal, Advan Journal of Advanced Materials by Yu Hong Jui and team from uh, 
University of Texas at Austin on fizz.org. Please leave your comments. Thank you for your support.